So are you at all worried that you'll be taken away from what you're really trying to do, especially now that you're in this uh, political discourse club? Definitely not. I think in terms of politics, STEM is relatively apolitical, as in your social takes will never really come up in like the classroom. Well, now there's the uh, environmental concerns. Well, they'll, they'll start to talk about how you can engineer around environmental solutions, or they can start talking about how you can engineer around worker shortages. But that's more of a, here's a problem and how you can solve it. And that, that conversation usually leads to a relatively apolitical conversation or tends to lean towards like a, you know, like a, like a slightly right-leaning free market solution type of uh, conversation. So I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not worried at all. But for you in poli side, that's, so what do you plan on doing yeah, after graduation? You, yeah, that's my question. Go ahead, Patrick. What are you going to do with that? You want to be president? Um, what do you want to do? Good Lord. Would I like to be president? Oh, would you? Okay. Um, um, firstly, right out of this, I'm going to go to law school uh, and just become a lawyer. Because let's be honest, there aren't many jobs for poli sci majors. I don't think there should be either. I'm a liberal arts major. I give nothing to society except for political thought. And we've got a lot of that <laughs> online already. So I'm going to go and become a lawyer. And that's essentially going to pay the bills until I can start running for political office. I've already, um, fun fact, I've already been elected as a Republican state delegate in Indiana. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. Um, it's, it sounds way more important than it is. I was supposed to go down to Indianapolis, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, last year. God, COVID's been such a... Um, I was supposed to go down, but COVID canceled the state convention. So I just voted by mail and I essentially get to vote for, I get to primary, but in Indiana, we're a Republican state. So the Republican primary picks the winner a lot of the time. Uh, I got to primary the AG and I think the treasurer and I ended up, uh, ended up really liking that experience. I'm definitely going to do it again. But it's it does sound a lot more important than it is. I just voted for one thing, and now I'm done, and I have to run again. But the goal is to eventually run for a national office and basically take the spirit of this podcast, the spirit of PDC, to Washington. I think the most important thing before everything is unity, and I think that I cringe a lot. I have a lot of sleepless nights about <laughs> um, the viability of my career path simply because everybody up in Washington has to keep the government together long enough for me to get there. I can't become a politician if you don't keep the government together long enough. So there have been a lot of sleepless nights about different issues and different ideas. So yes, politics will definitely affect how I can move on my chosen career path so oh, okay 